You got it on your mind. I can Hagen. get it off your chest. You you what it is, y'all? Terry, host of the show, man. Just stopping by, giving y'all a little motivational for the week. Instead of doing motivational Mondays and motivational Fridays, I'm just going to start calling them what it is, motivationals. Uh, just to get your spirits uplifted and, you know, get your week started, your weekend started, however, you know, however you want to do it. I mean, the Motivational Mondays and the Motivational Fridays was cool. You know, having people come on the show, uh, letting us know what motivates them is is very dope. That's a very dope uh, way of doing it. But I'm just going to change it up a little bit, start doing it by myself and, uh, you know, giving some motivational words, motivational quotes. Uh, anything to just help everybody get jump started, man. It's, it is uh, May, so May is mental mental health uh, month, which every day is technically mental health month. But uh, that being said, this is when it's mostly celebrated. Um, it is a celebration. You can celebrate mental health, man, because a lot of people overcome anxiety, a lot of people overcome depression, and they stay with it. Sometimes they get dragged back into it, but it is a real problem. But for those who are able to come out of it, you know, it's, it's definitely one of them things, a very, very big sense of accomplishment. So me, myself, had suffered from, you know, anxiety and depression and went through a, a spell that, you know, it's pretty much a rabbit hole that you constantly, constantly go down and can't get out of. But I was able to pull myself out of it. And um, I did that by uh, basically uplifting myself. I know that's kind of hard. For everybody to you know people to actually go through it it's kind of hard to actually think about and do but our bodies and our minds are meant to be trained they suck up information every day um body movements repetitive movements things like that it's the same way when it comes to your mind so you have to develop that every day you got to look at positive stuff every day you got to read positive stuff every day to get on YouTube, just look at videos of people who went through depression and anxiety and see what they did. And it's also not a problem to get help. You know, it's not an issue to get help. Like people, I know a lot of people are insecure about that, but getting help and being able to talk to somebody, getting help don't actually mean you have to go get a therapist, but it does mean someone who's close to you or that you feel is close to you, you can go and talk to about it and not really, it's someone that's not going to judge you, you know, that you feel is not going to judge you for it. But it's definitely that's the same thing. Getting help can be anything, you know, but talk to somebody, talk to somebody about it. Don't be too proud or too insecure to go and talk to somebody about your problems. Um, also, have a day to yourself. Go to the park, go to the mall, go ride around, go get something to eat. Just go do some stuff by yourself, man, and really think about, you know, some goals or anything that you want that you feel is going to push your life forward and have a goal and a purpose to live. I think a lot of us that go through anxiety and depression, lose our purpose to live, or we feel like we lost the purpose to live and you go through that spell and it's like, what next, you know? So definitely, you know, listen to some quotes, read a book, learn some things about yourself that you never knew and just take the time out to learn yourself. And, um, yeah, just find that special person that you can talk to and that you can rely on that's going to, you know, and if you want to get therapy, get therapy. What's, what's wrong with getting therapy? Can't nobody judge you for getting therapy. Don't nobody have to know you're getting therapy because a lot of the times people go through depression, anxiety and having mental health, mental health problems. They don't people around them don't know or they don't see the signs or they may just think they're a little off or having a bad week, bad month, but it's probably deeper than that. And that also goes for the people that are around of uh, your friend, family member, wife, husband, boyfriend, girlfriend, sister, brother, like look at the signs of the people that surround you. Look at the signs. Um, if you feel like somebody's off from how they normally act or if they're having emotional changes or you can just feel the vibe is off, take them to the side and, and just ask them, you know, I mean, the worst they can say is no. And keep it to themselves but at least you took the time out to try and ask i think a lot of us don't try and get to understand you know those around us because we feel like oh they cool you know what i'm saying they'll be all right you know, they, they get through it they tough a lot of people ain't tough man and even if they are everyone goes through something they just don't know how to express it so yeah i wouldn't go hold y'all up man not too long you know this is get off your chest podcast as always um, shout out to our sponsors as well. Make sure y'all cop some merch. $25 for the shirts. We shipping them off. However y'all want to do it, man. Catch the show every Tuesday. Every Tuesday we drop an episode. Every Wednesday we're live from 9 
Um, well, we live at nine every Wednesday. <laughs> so tune in. We also got CJ Chronicles out, man. I'm bringing you out a motivationals every week. So um, just continue to push, strive, and work hard. And uh, next time I'll probably bring you out some quotes and shit like that. But it's mental health. May, May is mental health month. So um, definitely tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend, and ask questions. Ask questions. And if you're going through mental health problems yourself or suffering from anxiety and depression, we've been there. So definitely, you know, hit us up. Hit us up in the DMs. Ask me anything. I done been through probably the worst of the worst of it to the point to where my body was doing things that I didn't even, I thought I had multiple symptoms of something wrong with me, which it was just my anxiety. So, but yeah, ask me anything, man. I'm pretty much an open book. So talk to me, DM me, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, YouTube, <laughs> Twitch. I'm everywhere. So, yeah. Didn't want to hold y'all up. Terry hosted the show. It's another motivational. We're starting them back. So make sure y'all tune in, like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Check out the rest of the uh, rest of the catalog and uh, get some merch. And we out. It's y'all Terry hosted the show, man. It's your boy CJ. Hey, man. We in this motherfucker, man. Tell them about the, tell them about the Chronicles, man. Man, CJ Chronicles, when I do my one-on-one thing with y'all, make sure y'all like, I'm subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. Hit that notification bell. It's YouTube slash Get It Off Your Chest podcast, man. Pull up on us if you're bored, you're chilling, whatever have you, man. Pull up. You got it on your mind, pop to get it off your chin. You got it on your mind, pop to get it off your chin. You got it on your mind, pop to get it off your chin. Get it, get it off your chin. Get it, get it off your chin. Get it off your chin. Get it, get it off your chin.